up next, it's a welterweight showcase between Connor, Notorious McGregor, and the Gambler. The Gambler, looking very confident tonight as he makes his way towards the Octagon. He is fired up and ready to fight. He's got tremendous boxing skills, Mike. If you watch his footwork, it is picture perfect. He uses angles well, has great head movement, and his punches are pinpoint accurate. Also, that jab of his is going to really let him dictate the pace of this fight if it stays on the feet. The Gambler steps inside the octagon, and he's ready to fight. Dublin, Ireland, the notorious one. Conor McGregor, the first ever two-weight champion back in his home country. He is as precise as any striker in the octagon today. And the national amateur boxing champion lacks no confidence as he enters the octagon again tonight. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan favorite combination. Conor McGregor is set for our main event of the evening. For this welterweight fight, the gambler is 18 years his elder. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. And with the official introductions, here's the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting at a Cologne, Germany, the Gambler. And now with his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 20 wins, three losses. Five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor. All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. They refuse to touch gloves. And this started at the weigh-in yesterday, where the stare-down was intense. It's time to get things started. Here you go. First run. You ready? Are you ready? Let's Here go. we go! Five five-minute rounds. Conor McGregor's opponent is so much taller than him. Joe, what does he have to do to try to counter him? He's got to figure out how to get inside. He's got to get inside the long range of his opponent, get inside the strikes, and work the body. Excellent feint with the kick. Great jab by McGregor. Wow. Oh, he got rocked! Oh, my goodness! Punches and bunches. He wants to finish.
excellent sweep winds up in guard. Good sweep. He's got half guard. Scrambles back to his feet. Nicely done. The gambler gets caught by the inside late kick. Great exchanges. Big knee to the body. You can tell that shot hurt him bad in the body. in the clinch by the gambler. And the knee to the body. Oh, that's a strong Muay Thai plum clinch. He lands a knee here. McGregor with some solid knees. That was a vicious knee that he just blocked. Joni lands another knee. He has really been good with those things. Oh, again with the knees. Final minute of the round. The gambler with a jab. Great defense as he blocks that body shot. Hard hook. Good block by McGregor. Joe, there's another shot to that cut that occurred earlier in the fight, and now it's really wide open. Yeah, he keeps tagging him right on that same spot. Perfect timing with his strikes. Can't connect with the jab. Look at that, he's timing that jab. And he pulls away. 15 seconds. McGregor gets hit with that left kick. Oh, nice kick. That's a big hook. Oh, what an exchange. Caught him with a big right hand. Big kick front kick, kick landed. In the face. What a way to work at the finish of this round. The gambler's thankful to still be in this fight after that round. He got cracked with some big shots before the bell. this punch and results in a knockdown. Here's a devastating kick that does some serious damage. And let's see if we can get a better look at that from another angle. Amazing highlights from that round. And there she is, the lovely Brittany. Are you ready? Are 
Yeah. Round two. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. McGregor gets hit with that body kick. Joe, look inside the numbers. Significant strikes landing. McGregor with the good jab. Fainting with that kick. The gambler's got a big bruise on the left side of his body. Nice kick to the body. Good hands, really mixing things up. Almost caught him. They are exchanging here, Mike. Oh, he's starting to tee off. Oh! He's been landing a lot of uppercuts in this fight. They could be a big factor. You're absolutely right, Joe. He's doing an awesome job, continuing to score with the uppercut. Conor McGregor is continuing to punish that eye. Yes, he is. That's a good target for him. He sees the swelling, and it's going to impede his opponent's vision. He's got heavy leg kicks. Looking to set up the uppercut. The gambler with a good jab. Another huge kick. He hurt him with that hook. Big shots. Solid jab. Oh, head kick. Vicious combinations. There he is! Got the takedown. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Oh, looking for his back. In half guard now. Back on their feet. Under three. Leg kick. The swelling in his eyes is starting to get worse. That huge head kick was blocked. Good keep by the gambler. Nice hook. Both men exchanging. And he parries it. There it is. Oh, look at that. What a jab. Hard straight punch. Oh, man, that leg kick did some damage. Huge knee to the body. Big shots. Vicious shots to the body. Just missed. Hurt him with that uppercut. Oh, look at that. Very nicely done. Now he's in the full guard. Excellent sweep. Looks for the choke here. Break the grip. He got it. He oh, got it's it. Over. Nicely it is done. Over. over. A beautiful job in setting up this arm bar. Excellent technique. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. And we see here, as soon as this arm bar gets locked in, there is no escape. Perfect technique, tremendous pressure. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And one more time, nice technique here on this submission. With the official decision, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mallory Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 48 seconds of round number 2. To play the winner by submission, we do it one bar, The Gambler! The Gambler, your winner by submission.